Welcome. This is the love reading for the month of November. I want to say thank you so much for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration. Please remember to share, share these videos, whatever is happening, and transpiring. Share, share, share. These love readings are coming up for the month of November. And ladies and gentlemen, I want to say thank you for um, supporting my channel in whatever way you do. We are now at 33,000, so thanks. These love readings are uh, free, so um, if you would like to have your personalized love reading, you can always use the link below to order your love reading. Okay, I think that love is so powerful, um, it's uh, free to know what's coming up. Okay, so let's get in it we're calling up on the angels of love the cupid angels and all the legions of angels to come in and show us what is happening for love in this month um oops a lot is happening for love in this month so we see past past life relationship i'm seeing the exes coming back the exes want a new chance for with you guys I'm seeing short-term love, freedom for the mature women, and I'm seeing true love coming in. So a lot of you are going to be finding out that you're having passionate relationship with your true love, however that is coming up, okay? So what we're seeing is some um, passion coming in, but the passion that is coming in is going to be short time and it's with someone from the past okay the lightning is the lightning it isn't good so um we're just gonna work with this okay so um let's see what is going to be happening and transpiring in love for you guys so what we're basically seeing happening is that past love is coming back a whole lot of you are going to be connecting with past love that is coming back um past relationship past love is coming back however this is coming up we're going to be looking to see who are these past love who is it going to be affecting okay so we're seeing heartbreaks in the past with love for some of you and this could affect the um the leos the um the liberans um and i'm seeing the capricorns are going to be having a short relationship with a um a libran short relationship with a libran i'm seeing money taking place where the virgos are going to be in love triangles so i'm seeing the virgos coming up in love triangles the virgos are really coming up in love triangles whatever that is transpiring i'm seeing the virgos coming up in love triangles um the Librans are going to be connecting but um it's like with past love okay i'm seeing some of you in triangles with the fire sign people you're going to be in some love triangles with a virgo that's coming up then i'm seeing an offer so someone from the past could be coming back in because they want to start something new with you. And whoever this person is, I'm seeing a lot of uh, a lot of uh, liberals are returning. They they it's as if some of you liberals had some passionate relationship with um, an Aries that is coming up. I'm seeing um. A Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, um, women, you want your freedom, you're having these short-term relationships, you're having these short-term passionate relationship with Aries people, but I'm um, seeing that you want to stay free and open. I'm seeing um, the Capricorns is coming in, um, the Capricorns and the Virgos, I'm seeing um, some of you Capricorns and Virgo could be in a um, it could be in a relationship, but it's like 
or love triangle relationship. So you got to be aware of what is happening because you're coming up like in a love triangle relationship. You got to be aware of this. Then um, I'm seeing the energy of, uh, uh, yeah, the Virgos are in these love triangles. So whatever is happening with you Virgos out there, you're Virgos and you got to listen to your own love readings, you Virgos, because I'm seeing you coming up in a lot of love triangles, okay? Then I'm seeing some conflicts with people who are in passion. I'm seeing conflicts coming up. Um, the um, Aquarians are in uh, um, having conflicts. Um, you are meeting someone who is a true love but there is some conflicts okay i'm seeing some of you um are having hot passionate relationships so the cancers are having some hot passionate relationship with the aquarius and the aries so i'm seeing a, a, a cancer man me, the cancer men and women 45 years and older you're coming up in some real hot passionate but i'm seeing the women want their freedom okay then the Pisces, Pisces, I'm seeing the Pisces are here. The Pisces want their freedoms, okay? And uh, they could be wanting to divorce. The Pisces want their freedom and they could be wanting to divorce. If you are a Pisces woman, 45 years and older, I'm seeing you want your freedom, you want a divorce. We have uh, the energy of the Pisces, uh, the Pisces want, are in some fun relationship with the Virgos. So I'm seeing the Pisces coming up in some fun relationship with the Virgos. Um, Pisces are connected with the Virgos and having some fun relationship, fun times with a Virgo. Um, you Pisces could be lawyers. If you buy Pisces or lawyers, I'm seeing you having really some fun time in relationship. Then we see some of you are going to be finding the love of your lifetime. Um, and uh, some of you could be starting a new relationship with the love of uh, your life. And this could affect the Leos and the Sagittarian are going to be finding the love of their life. True love is coming in. I am seeing the Virgos again, especially the Virgo women are going to be meeting true love. A Virgo women, four to five years and older, you're going to meet your true love, and that is going to be a cancer. So you Virgos, four to five years and older, is going to be meeting a true love, and it is a cancer. I'm seeing the fire sign coming in, and the fire sign women, four to five years and older, you're going to be connecting with the Pisces, okay? So the fire sign women, four to five years and older, nay, um... Fire sign, the, the fire sign women could be connecting, if you're between the ages of 18 and 45, you could be connecting with all the Pisces. Definitely, I'm seeing some of you want to get divorced. Some of you want to get divorced. I'm seeing a lot of you Pisces going on dating. So a lot of the Pisces are going on dating. So wow this is good um the only thing i haven't seen is the gemini i'm not seeing the gemini coming up in this love energy i'm not seeing love coming out for the gemini's yet so the gemini's you have to go and check out your energy vibration for the love reading um for you gemini okay your own energy vibration for the love reading because i'm not really seeing you coming up in this reading okay so you got to be aware of what is transpiring so there is a lot of situation because i'm seeing um especially the liberance you are looking for your um people from past life you're you're connecting with people who in love from past life is coming up for you liberance so whatever the situation is i'm seeing you guys are trying to connect uh, with people from past life so who are the people who are going to be connected with people from past life is the liberans um the liberans the aries i'm seeing an offer is coming um from um people in past life and the pisces or cancers okay i'm seeing some of you um 
women um um okay there is conflicts there is conflicts some of you um women 45 years and older that is a pisces cancer or scorpion if you you can you if you women that are cancers add some conflicts with a capricorn or a pisces this is going to be over okay the conflicts is in reverse so then um i'm seeing justice justice coming up and whatever heart breaks it could be that you had divorced it could be that you have met someone in the past i'm seeing um if you're divorcing you're going to be receiving an offer so if you're divorcing a capricorn um you're going to be receiving an offer i'm seeing heartbreaks that some of you women you um cancer women could be dealing with heartbreaks and it has to do with a libran okay short-term relationship i'm seeing some of you protecting yourself from short-term relationships um some of you are definitely protecting yourself from short-term relationship and but what is really happening with these short-term relationships is that some of you are like, I don't want to begin something that is not going to last for a lifetime. Some of you are dealing with the Capricorns and some of you are dealing with the, the Virgos. Okay. And I'm seeing some of you women, um, you water sign women, well, um, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, four or five years and older. I'm seeing you had an heartbreak. You're coming to a divorce. Okay. Wow. Then we see a love triangle. And the love triangle that is happening, it has to do with the Virgos and the Capricorn are in love triangles. The Aries and the Virgos are in love triangles. So I'm seeing a lot of Aries and Virgos who are in a love triangle. So the people who are in love triangle, what is going to be transpiring with the people who are in love triangles? It's affecting the cap the the capricorn the virgos the taurus also i'm seeing the uh, sagittarians um and the leos could be uh, sagittarius and ophiosus sagittarius and ophiosus um are in these love triangles where it is hard for them to make a decision um to who they're going to access the passion the passion is dealing with the Aries people are in this passionate relationship. Um, it is good. Um, some of you Aries could be in a relationship with an Aquarian and it's very passionate. Um, an Aquarian could be in a relationship with a Pisces, with a Cancer that is very passionate. And you're going to create a baby. Ladies and gentlemen, you're going to be creating a baby. Some of you could be meeting um, an Aquarius an Aries and a, um, a cancer and you cancer women 45 years and older you could be getting pregnant you got to be careful people in these passionate relationship pregnancy is being alerted you gotta be aware there's pregnancy if you don't want to get pregnant you got to you got to use protection fun time who are having fun time some of you had some fun time heartbreaks heartbreaks with a Capricorn and a Taurus art breaks uh, with a Pisces. Uh, yeah, so the Pisces and Capricorns who are having some fun time. Um, yes, and the and the Virgos, there's going to be some heartbreaks. So be aware of this. What is going to be transpiring? True love, a new start to love relationship. And you start to love relationship, whatever is happening and transpiring. There is a new start to love relationship. I'm seeing um, the um, Leos are meeting their true love. I'm seeing Aquarians meeting their true love. The Cancers are meeting their true love. And the Tauruses are going to be meeting their true love. If you are looking for a relationship, um, a relationship is going to be coming out of this because you're meeting your true love women 45 years and older you cancers you um tauruses and pisces and uh, aries leo or sagittarian you're coming up i am seeing the energy of the devil 
So you women are good, you know, if you're four or five years and older, I am seeing that you're finding out something about your partner. Now, if your partner is an Aries, I'm seeing you finding out something about your partner. If your partner is a, um, a Taurus, I'm seeing you finding out something about the Taurus. If your partner is, um, is a cancer, I'm seeing you finding out something. If you're in relationship with these people, there could be negative energy that affected it. it is not, your relationship. It is now over. Deceptiveness. Um, some of you are divorcing. There's conflicts in this divorce. Some of you could be divorcing um, a Aquarians. There is conflicts. A Aquarians could have done something. I'm seeing um, you're divorcing. Whoever is divorcing, I am seeing that there is going to be some conflict. So if you are divorcing or is going to be planning on divorcing, I'm seeing some conflicts. So some of you are dealing with a young Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius in a relationship. I'm seeing a conflict if you're going to divorce this person. There's definitely some, some conflicts. Eight. Some of you, if uh, you are in a relationship... Uh, with a Pisces, you're going to be winning, okay? You're going to be winning. So as as if if a Pisces was um if a Pisces wasn't honest, you're going to be finding this out. So be aware of this. So I'm seeing um cost of the battles, but um and and some of you who are in these passionate relationship use a condom because you're definitely going to be getting married. Uh, getting um pregnant and if you don't want a child then i'm seeing that happen some of you are going to have a new start with a taurus some of you could have a new so some of you um aquarians are going to be getting pregnant let's say you're in this passionate relationship with someone it is something that is going on and off you're going to be getting pregnant so you got to be aware i'm seeing definitely divorces divorces the women the water sign women 45 years and older i'm seeing that you're you're hurt by the divorce that is coming up you're definitely hurt by the divorce that is coming up and whatever is happening and transpiring i'm seeing you definitely are um but i'm i'm, I'm seeing a lot of uh, especially the leos that is getting involved uh, with uh, if the leos are getting involved uh, with uh, um the Tauruses, I'm seeing a new start. I'm seeing that in the past there was some conflicts, but now the conflict is over. I'm seeing a lot of you protecting yourself from short-term relationship. A lot of you Capricorns, a lot of you um uh Virgos are protecting yourself from um short-term relationship. Is that you're saying no, this is not for me? Yeah, you know, no, I'm um that's this is not what I want. I'm seeing you guys really just protecting yourself. So I'm seeing justice coming up where justice is balancing out issues. So some of you women could have been cheated on. So if you are in a relationship with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion woman, um, you might be cheated on or they. I'm seeing blockages is coming up. Um, blockages, I'm seeing a relationship ending. Some of you could be ending a relationship with a Sagittarius or a Gemini because there's, uh, or, or a, um, Libran. Some of you are ending a relationship with a, a Gemini or a Libran and I'm seeing blockages coming up. Okay. Whatever is transpiring, I think that someone is blocking this communication. Then what I'm seeing with babies, I, I'm seeing that some of you men who were in passionate relationship with someone and they found out that they were pregnant. I'm seeing you men saying, hey, um, I don't want to have the child because I already have kids. Okay. I'm seeing you saying, I don't want to have the child because I already have kids. I am seeing this is um some of you finding yourself understanding who you are seeing 
Um, some of you are realizing that this happy time and this fun time is not really working out for me. Some of you are going back and realizing, especially you women 45 years and older, you found out something about your partner. Whatever it is, you have definitely found out something about your partner, okay? I'm seeing news coming in for the Capricorns. This is a new offer of love is coming in for the Capricorns. I am seeing the Virgos are want, going to um, want to get pregnant. I am seeing um, um, the Sagittarians who are in love triangle. It is with a friend. <laughs> okay. And I, I always laugh. Don't take it serious because a Sagittarius... Some of you Sagittarius is in a love triangle with a friend, okay? And this is someone who you have known from past lifetime. And I think some of you want to end this relationship, but it's not really happening. All right, so you Virgos are really in this love thing. I'm seeing complications at home for you Virgos because it's as if your partner realized what you have been doing. There is complication for you, Virgos, because your, your partner realized what you have been doing. So there is complications for you, Virgos, okay? There's definitely complications for you, Virgos. Okay, another two energies is coming out. I'm seeing a lot of people are jealous. A lot of jealousy is coming to some of you, I think some of you have met a cancer. Some of you could be dealing with a cancer, very jealous person. Um, very jealous person. Um, this person could be very rich, very jealous person. I'm seeing a resolution that is coming in. Um, if there was some deceptiveness in your relationship, I am seeing that some of you ladies might be saying, hey, let's let this go and uh, um, I'm cool. You know, just let it go. I'm cool. I'm seeing unexpected luck that is going to be coming in. Where am um, a Taurus? You are going to be starting. Um, you have found your true love. You Tauruses have found your true love, and you want to make it. Uh, you really want to make it uh, stick. Like you're saying, hey, I know this is the person. Um, for myself okay I know this is the person for myself so I'm seeing a lot of dating happening in the month of November whatever is happening whatever is transpire there is a lot of dating happening um, in the month of November I'm seeing a lot of you are really happy going out celebrating um, co connecting with you and your partner is connecting up a positive in a positive direction really really wonderful really positive so this is really really um good coming out so wonderful positive energies that is here in love that is coming up i'm seeing a lot of surprises like a lot of uh, you are going to be surprising to meet the love of your life some of you are going to be receiving like unexpected surprises from your partners uh, i'm not seeing the wife and husband coming up here i'm not seeing any marriages but i'm seeing divorce final in or people are going to be starting to get uh, uh, to make arrangements to divorce that sort of a thing but i'm seeing like a wonderful new stability is really coming in your in the lives but i'm seeing blockages coming up for the capricorn but whatever the art break was i'm seeing the blockages coming up and i want to find out because it could be emotional blockages that is coming in. It could be that um, some of the Capricorns are saying, I really don't want to be in this. Okay, so um, that could be um, coming up. So why is this blockage for in love? Because it, it has to do with the Capricorns. And I'm thinking it's the more prestigious Capricorn or either blocking themselves from love and not opening up to love. I'm seeing... Um, the blockages or um between the the capricorn men or women i'm seeing 
um, this blockages is coming up also for um, older women, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. I'm seeing that a circle, a cycle in love relationship is over. A circle, a cycle in love relationship is over. Okay. So I'm seeing that sort of a blockage is coming up. But luck is with the Tauruses. It's good. Um, whatever is happening in the love life of the Tauruses, I'm seeing you meeting your true love. The Tauruses and the Leos are meeting their true loves. Also the Aquarians, and I'm seeing new start in love. So let's say that you have not a relationship for quite some time. I'm seeing you meeting a true love for the Aquarians. This true love is you're going to have some hot, passionate um, sex, but you're going to end up getting pregnant for this person. I'm seeing um, you young men, men, um, young cancers. You got to be careful, you young cancers, because remember, whatever you give out, if you deceive someone in a relationship, I'm seeing this coming back to you. So if you deceive someone in a relationship, I am seeing this coming back to you. I really love, love this um, month of love. It's as if... We're all, you know, looking for the right person. Um, the most of you, except the Gemini's, I'm not seeing what, what was coming up for the Gemini's. I don't see the Gemini's coming out in love. So you got to go check out the original Gemini reading for love in this month. But for the rest of the signs, I see a whole lot of stuff that is going on here. The Aquarians are definitely going to be here. The Aquarians, but also the Librans, they're coming up in love. I'm seeing divorces, Sagittarians or here, the Aries or here. So there is, you know, basically a lot of people that is coming up in love. Definitely. Um, whoever is having these passionate sex, I'm seeing that you are definitely going to be pregnant. Um, so let's hope that that is what you want. But I'm seeing that there is a young cancer that found out that someone is pregnant for you and you're going to say, no, I'm sorry, I can't have it because I have other kids. I have another family. So I am seeing heartbreaks coming up and that sort of a thing. But not to worry about what is transpiring and what is happening. Um, you know, life is full of surprises. I'm seeing really positive energies that is coming in. So... Please like, share these love readings. Um, um, always go check out and share, share, share these love videos. Um, you know, go in um, and check out your original um, zodiac sign. Check out for your partners to see what your partners are up to. So um, I want to wish you guys a really wonderful month of love. And um, please like and share this video and share, share, share. Put on your notification button that if I'm sending out anything new, you will be there. I want to say to each and every person, love is the only thing that is real. I'm sending a lot of love, pure light and love to you guys. Please remember that life is full of surprises. Relationship can change from one time to another we are not choosing and we can't choose the people we want to be with if someone wants to go we gotta let them go namaste